Yeah, it's going to be one of those weekends you're going to want to get out and be awake, alive, and happy. <laughs> and it's going to be hard to be anything but happy with a forecast like this. I'm going to get you outside, see what's going on. I first want to show you this uh, picture sent in last night. I mean, look at that. Lots of folks enjoyed Friday Night Lights in terms of high school football games. But Gene enjoyed this one, a little different out over Lake Eustis. And when you have a sunset like that on a Friday night, you know it is going to be just a wonderful weekend. Here's a live look outside. Universal Studios, of course, it is still dark outside. And uh, there's only the ma uh, maintenance crews out and about, but it's a nice and quiet start to the day across the attraction. 72 degrees, just a few clouds around. But just north of town, we find some nice cool temperatures 64 degrees in Reddick, 62 in Romeo, 63 in the villages. We're waking up to 72 in Mount Dora, 65 to land, 66, uh, 66 at the Spruce Creek Flying Community, about 71 degrees in Altamont Springs, Bithlow waking up to 71 degrees, 73 on Merritt Island, 70 degrees flat in Malabar, and about uh, 71 in Palm Bay. Now, our northern area is a little cooler this morning than yesterday, about uh, 3, 4, 5 degrees or so, and it's a nice and comfy start. We've been watching a little bit of fog here in our northern areas, but uh, visibility already has improved in Ocala. Yesterday, remember, we had those dense fog advisories. That's not the case this morning. So, all things considered, just know there could be a little bit of patchy fog. But a great start to the day if you're out and about enjoying the fun coast buddy walk up in Palm Coast this morning. Temperatures, though, once the sun comes up, quickly climb. So, uh, dress accordingly, to say the least. As far as the forecast goes, we will see plenty of sunshine. Look at the infrared satellite imagery. There's nothing to track, just some showers down around the Straits into Cuba. Uh, but for us, high pressure is the rule. And when you get high pressure, you get sunny skies, but just to our north and west, Mississippi, Arkansas, Louisiana, starting to see some rain associated with this next cold front. And look at the temperatures 30s, 40s, 50s. That's all going to drive our way over the next couple of days' time. For today, no cool weather, though, well above average. 90 degrees in Webster again, about 88 in Oviedo, 89 in Kissimmee. Consider that our average high is about 86, to put that into perspective. About 86 on Merritt Island, 87 degrees, New Smyrna Beach. And if you're heading up to the swamp tonight, looks like a great forecast as the LSU Tigers come to town. Talking about temperatures in the upper 80s for tailgate, drink plenty. Of water to keep yourself hydrated, and then as we get towards kickoff, the sun sets, temperatures will fall into the upper range of the 70s. First alert, seven day forecast looks like this a few coastal sprinkles today and tomorrow. Then Tuesday, Wednesday, notice rain chances go up as that cold front arrives, and then once the rain chances come back down, so do the temperatures. A bit cooler for your Thursday and your Friday.